Hi YouTube, this is Tamika Anumi1109. This is a video response to Sky8725. Um, I watched a video this morning and it was talking about weight loss surgery support groups. And in that video you asked a few questions or you touched on a, a couple different topics. And once I started actually trying to respond in the comment section I ran out of room so I decided video response was in order. So here I am. First of all, I want to talk about stuck episodes. Now, when I went through the bariatric program, and, and you know, I just have, want to remind everybody, it took me a year for me to mentally get my mind together to lose the few pounds that I needed to lose in order to get my surgery date scheduled. So I took various classes, um, participated in uh, several different support groups and all of that during that time frame, um, and I found them to be very helpful. Even in the beginning before I even went to my primary care physician to talk about um, the possibility of him sending over, over a referral for me to the bariatric program, um, I actually just went to latband.com. Um, and selected a doctor that was having um, sort of a seminar in my area so that I would get an outside perspective of weight loss surgery and that band in general outside of something that my doctor, my primary care would be telling me um, and anybody else that could potentially be doing the surgery. So I did that first and when I went to that seminar before the seminar, there was a support group for pre-op patients, and after the seminar, there was a support group for um, post-op patients. And of course, it was very exciting because at some point, you know, a lady walked in and she had a, a pair of her old jeans, and she fit both of her legs in um, one leg, and um, all of that. That was very exciting. They had uh, tons of before and after pictures and all of that. And at that point, I was even uh, thinking about going the route of self-pay before I decided to approach my doctor um, one last time well this would have been the first time for him but I've actually talked to a doctor before in the past several years ago about weight loss surgery and it didn't work out so um, where was I I just rambled <laughs> support groups there is actually a support group two minutes away like literally two minutes away from my house every Thursday night seven o'clock I've not yet attended I said that I would right after surgery I found out about it I think a week before surgery so right after surgery I said for sure I'm going I'm going to go it's right there it's close there's no excuse and then I started scheduling um, I have a, a scheduled meeting that takes place uh, two Thursdays out of the month and and I don't want to sort of do it um, half-heartedly, so I've not made the time to go do it. I know that might sound like an excuse, but I haven't done it. And I have another reason, too. So when I was going through the bariatric program and going to various classes and got to the last class that I actually had to take, it was my um, pre-op surgery class. In that class, there were probably about 12, 13 people, and I was the only lap bander. And I sort of found over time that when I would go to different classes, I would go to different message boards. There's a Yahoo message board specifically for uh, my doctor's office's um, sort of bariatric program. I found that there were more gastric um, bypass patients than lap band patients. And that made me do a little second guessing because I was thinking at some point, you know, is this the right surgery for me? Should I be going the other route? I knew why I picked lap band. Um, and in the end, I decided to continue with my initial thought, and I'm glad that I did. Um, but, you know, I'm almost feeling like this support group that is right near my home is probably going to be more um, gastric patients than lap banders. And although we both had weight loss surgery, there are definitely some differences between the two. And so if, if I was to somehow be able to find a support group that was um, specifically for lap band patients, I think I would be all over it. 
I think that we would be able to share different stories and you know talk about different things that we have in common and I think it would probably be a little bit more beneficial for me.